I used to walk to school down here every day. Cobb Co was there, I think. He comes with all the trappings of a rock star, but there was a time when Billy Thorpe was just another kid growing up on the border of Salisbury and Maruka. My parents owned these three stores. We came out here, uh, we came to Maruka in about 1956 or 57. Now an electrician shop, this used to be where Billy and his family lived. In fact, it was on this spot where 10-year-old Billy was sitting on an orange crate, strumming a guitar and singing, when a woman came into the shop looking for directions, who just happened to be a talent scout for a kid show called the Channel Niners. I auditioned and was signed to Channel Nine, and this is where I was discovered, right here. It's almost summer. He might have started on an orange crate, but Billy Thorpe has been strutting the world stage ever since and coming back frequently to the old neighbourhood. I always felt uh, a feeling of pride from the people because we, I was just a local kid. A local kid who was playing concerts at night and turning up late for school the next day. That didn't exactly make him teacher's pet. The headmaster here who's now long dead told me I'd never amount to anything, so first thing I did when I had money was I bought one of the James Bond Aston Martins, drove it straight up here, waited for assembly and did a wheelie around the quadrangle in front of all the kids.